This is actually pieces of Ophelia wow. still kind of swirling around. Yeah, a lot of showers headed our way. We're not looking at a tropical storm, but certainly bringing quite a bit of rain to parts of the northeast. Let's take a look at what's going on. First of all, up in Lincoln, where we've been seeing a few rain showers here and there throughout the uh, morning so far. Here's the uh, radar and you can see uh, especially the western half of Rhode Island seeing some scattered showers briefly heavy down here and westerly into uh, Hopkinton is all headed on off to the north some more showers about ready to work their way into Little Compton and Newport all right here the Threat tracker for today. For now, low, I'm uh, considering maybe kind of bumping it up, maybe just in case uh, we do start to see some heavier elements of rain become more widespread. Uh, Saturday, generally pretty quiet. We do have rain for the first half of the day. And then Sunday, looking beautiful. Here are the temperatures right now. We are in the 50s, 53 in Coventry, 56 Providence, Newport at 56. So a lot of showers coming northward. And they're kind of heavy expected to be quite heavy in the New York City area as we go through the next 24 hours. In fact, there could be uh, some uh, widespread flooding uh, there in uh, the New York City area. We'll get back to that in a second. Here's the culprit area of low pressure. All the moisture still kind of uh, associated with Ophelia is going to be working up into uh, the northeast over the next 24 hours for us in terms of how much uh, uh, potential there is for us seeing any flooding on a scale of one to five, about a one for uh, most of our area. Uh, Connecticut, slight chance, but it's here in the New York City area, Long Island, Southwest Connecticut to New Jersey, highly populated area, a lot of cement here, so it's tougher for the uh, rain to find somewhere to drain into. There could be some uh, flooding here as they could be looking at six, seven, maybe eight inches of rain or more as a result of all this rain coming up the coastline. Let's time it out. Heavy rain off to our west, scattered showers for us as we go through the daytime today and overnight tonight, and this is eight o'clock tomorrow morning. Still looking at some showers, kind of pinwheeling into southern New England. And then finally, we begin to dry out late in the day tomorrow and Sunday looking beautiful with plenty of sunshine and we're staying dry for a little while after that. So for today, we've got scattered showers in the forecast, some of which could be briefly heavy temperatures in the low to mid 60s for today. We are looking at more showers, some of which could be a little on the heavy side through the nighttime tonight. And then for tomorrow, we are looking at yeah, more of the same scattered showers to begin the day. But I'm thinking the showers come to an end sometime noontime 2 p.m. And then we'll begin to dry out with the skies slowly clearing. Temperatures topping out about 65. Kind of breezy tomorrow. Once we get by Saturday, we are looking at much better weather. Sunday right through next Thursday. In fact, a bit of a warming trend with temperatures in the mid to upper 70s. Looks great for next week. Full forecast, a lot more weather information. You can always find that on our website. That's at WPRI.com.